The university offered fresh challenges, but she found kindred spirits in the Socialist Forum, a group formed by disaffected communists with a shared love of Russian folk dancing. It was then she adopted English as a second language. It was later as a young lawyer she was to become romantically and professionally involved with a shady union leader and former Charleston champion. Leaving the law firm in disgrace, she found solace with the group Evelyn's Pissed, a traveling river dance troupe. Here she met her next lover. But politics beckoned and Julia took up with a fellow poly and sometimes contact lens swallower. Never content, as a deputy, there was one more hurdle to clear. With the top job won, she could now offer her complete support for people smugglers, easily smashing all previous records. But the whiff of scandal was never far away, and forces were closing in fast. Next time, part three, For Whom the Bells Poll.